Hello, Alexis. How are you today? Hello, Letty. I'm fine. Thank you. Uh, today it is, is a beautiful Sunday. sunny day. I thought of you. I'm still in t-shirt. <laughs> in our place, not, not so sunny, but also good. Right. So here we have five questions. Let's see what you tell me about these five questions. What was the best thing that happened to you today? Okay. Today is Sunday and uh, this day, uh, last day of October is the uh, birthday of my mother-in-law and we visit her together with all my family and congratulate her and uh, have a nice talk. Right, so today is your mother-in-law's birthday. So yes. you went to visit her with everybody from the family and you congratulated her and wished her all the best. Yes. Did she have a cake? Um, well, yes, we eat uh, cake, um, we bring it. Uh, we bought it before in the supermarket. And, and, right, uh, so you took her a cake and you ate it all together, the cake. Yes. And can we ask how old she is? Um, she's 84 years old. Right, wow. So she's doing very well. No? 84 is a good age. Yes. Right then. And who is your hero? Uh, when, when I... Uh... Uh, look at these questions a little bit difficult maybe nobody but uh, i think uh, i uh, i watch um, rewatch uh, some movie not not so many times ago it was forest gump and i love this uh, film and uh, forest is my hero <laughs> right so not so long ago you watched the film uh, forest gump and uh, for you you like this character in the yes. film what yes. did you like about him uh his behavior he is a uh, simple maybe a little bit stupid but <laughs> eventually he became a, a, he achieved all and uh, stay as he was and uh, i think it's a good example and a good uh, description on on Right, so maybe it was a little simple, this is what you're saying, but uh, whatever he set out to do, he did it. And so this is what you liked. It's a film I saw a long time ago, so I can't remember it very well, but I didn't understand it. I just found it very confusing, maybe because at that time I was younger, I don't know. But I just found the way of the film a little confusing, but that's me. Uh, I like the idea he used to eat chocolates, I think, near the end. He sat there with a, a box of chocolates and he was eating them. But, uh, and as you said, it went through different moments of his life and different things that he had to do, no? But I think his heart was very uh, noble. And like you said, he tried to uh, please as many people as he could. Right. What would you change if you could? <coughs> hmm. Also really difficult questions. Uh, maybe I would like to spend all my time more consciously. <laughs> Sometimes uh, I have to do maybe uh, not so wish and not so interesting for me. Maybe I don't understand why, but it's I responsible and for this or for that and do it. And sometimes I it's a little bit of look like a conflict in my mind, in my duties. And so you, I think, if I understand that you spend too much time working and doing your responsibilities because that's the way you are. But you would like to spend more time doing what? Um, of course, I have different uh, roles in my life. I am husband, I am a uh, uh, worker, uh, I'm as a maybe a little business. Uh, I have to, I'm responsible uh, to do something in my job, and I father and I son. And in that, uh, uh, in this and this, uh, I have to do all my, all my best. And I would like to do it um, maybe 
more consciously, well ah, prepared. You didn't like to do it better than you are doing it now. It, maybe yes, yes, yes. Because uh, sometimes I'm not well prepared, and uh, I'm uh, more reactive than <laughs> proactive. Right. Maybe you're a bit hard on yourself. <laughs> But uh, your uh, your personality of being responsible, uh, your duty, etc. No, but mm -hmm. uh, you would like to do things uh, better in a more mm -hmm. active way. And what really makes you angry? Oh, here yeah, a lot of things. Um, <laughs> sometimes uh, interruptions, stupid behavior, impatience. When somebody forgot our agreements uh, and uh, people don't keep their promise, they don't keep their word, they don't know how to behave anymore. No, they don't know uh, civil uh, rules of how we should behave and respect each other. Mm. People have lost this, no? Yes, people have lost, but it's also something uh, which can be improved internal in me because i'm not also impatient <laughs> be impatient and i can forgive maybe somebody and i, I forgot about this i think we <clears throat> should work um to better ourselves and uh respect each other mutually no and i don't yes. think we do and that yes. makes life more difficult no Yes, it makes life more difficult, but maybe more interesting, as I understand uh, you correct this. Uh... Yeah, but I get tired with people because they don't um, respect each other and they're not understanding. Yes. Uh, uh, it's easy to complain, it's easy to ask for, but do you understand what the other person is doing and the life of the other person? So maybe you wouldn't um, be so, um, I don't know the word now, it's gone out of my head. But you, you would be more understanding. More understanding. Yes, I agree. And we are more selfish and we don't like to listen. <laughs> and we would like to give our own opinion. And uh, Yes, so uh, that's it. That was a good one. People don't listen. Uh, for example, I organized... Um, a little something for my students at the academy on Wednesday. And I was very nervous because I had to dress up and I didn't feel comfortable in the costume because it's not me, but I tried my best. And also I was singing and I was do, uh, give, uh, doing different things. And we bought sweets for everybody. Uh, we did our best, but that wasn't good enough because as we are human, things didn't go out 100% the way we wanted it to. And um, some people didn't come and they said, oh, you have uh, our sweets to give us tomorrow. And I said, no, because what we have done is giving out all the sweets so we didn't have any left. And we give it out to the older children. And they, they were very annoyed that we hadn't kept the sweets and I thought, well, if you want to come, you make an effort to come on that day and you get the sweets. If you don't come, I just gave them out to other children that they were there. And it was one thing and after another, the parents complaining. And I just felt like saying, why did I bother? No, because people are not understanding. So thank you, Alex, for answering me those questions and sharing your opinions with me.